Flats V speaking to Chelsea midfielder Henry Otching after the win here at Harbour in the trophy. Henry, a good day for, for the team there? Yeah, definitely. We've obviously come here looking to win and we've come here and done that. So we're happy to go and be in the hat for the next round. But that, that was a really tough game. They're flying in their league, top of the league. I think one loss all season, I think, in all competitions or couples. So they, they were really up for it, weren't they? Yeah, they were. And obviously we can't underestimate teams like this when we come here. Um, despite obviously being a few leagues lower than us, they, they gave it their all and we had to come here and do a job and that's what we did. It was good getting that early goal, wasn't it? It sort of just settled us down. Yeah, no, that's obviously you come here and try to impose yourself on the game, but getting an early lead like that helps definitely. So it was good for Jonesy to just put it away and build his confidence for the game. But yeah, they were, they were sort of, we had a couple of chances to sort of make it a little bit easier for ourselves and then the sending off happens and it's it's a very, it's a tough game after that. Yeah, the game can change in, in a split second. So it's how we react and deal with it. And I thought we dealt with it very well. Yeah, that was a, a, a brave sub for, for Robbie to change and put two strikers on when we're, we're down to 10 men, but it, it worked because Kenny sort of created a couple of opportunities we could have scored before we did. Yeah, it just shows the gaffer's tactical awareness uh, and what he can actually do, and it also shows the strength of our bench as well. Uh, players can come on and change the game, so it was great for the team and great for the management as well. And uh, then, obviously, your goal, talk us through that as we saw it. Another Henry Ocheng scream, as you called it. Yeah, no, I just felt like it was there, it set up nice for me, so why not? And you, ca you, can't, you can't score if you don't shoot, so I'm happy it went in. Yeah, and that was sort of, it was a crucial time because we just got sort of on top and we, and you know, it, it sort of put the game to bed, really. Yeah, it did, and uh, I think it eased the, the pressure on us for the last 20 minutes. Um, obviously, being 2 0 up, it kind of helps the team just relax into those last few minutes, and that's, that's, that's happy that I did that. I said to Robbie there, sort of, they were similar to Dartford and Avery, quite a lot of balls in the box, sort of, we had to defend stoutly there, and we've, we've come through it again. Yeah, 2 0, it's a clean sheet, we can't complain. Um, obviously, there's still room for improvement, so we can go away and, and look at that, but uh, we're happy to just keep a clean sheet today as well. Yeah, and uh, back to Melbourne on Monday for another tough game against Maidstone in around us in the playoffs. Yeah, another tough one. Uh, I think the boys can just regroup, recover, uh, quick turnaround, and we just take it into Monday and see what we can do. Yeah, well, I think we spoke to you before you'd come back, and now you've played a few games, how are you sort of settling back into Chelmsford City life? Yeah, I'm happy to be back. The boys are great. They've all welcomed me back, and it's, it's a very good group, and we're doing well in the league, we're doing well in the cup, so it's just about keeping on that run and, and being consistent. Yeah, really well done today, Henry, on, on the goal, and uh, look forward to a few more like that, hopefully. Yeah. And uh, also, good luck on Monday. Cheers, thank you very much.